Severe weather possible for your Sunday and we have cooler temperatures on tap for next week. I'll have details on that on today's web weather. Well, temperatures right now on our tower cam and 97 degrees here in Denison and Sherman. That record today is 102 and we're feeling close to 100 degrees. Mostly sunny, some clouds out there. These were our recorded high temperatures so far today, and it's been close to 100 degrees for some locations. 98 for Ardmore, 98 for Bernieville, close to 100 for Antlers, low 90s for southeastern Oklahoma. Going into this evening, it will still be hot with mostly sunny skies, some clouds out there, low 90s going into the evening hours, mid to upper 80s. Tomorrow, things really start to change. We have a chance for severe weather. We have a level one out of five risk for counties along the I-35 corridor. And then as we further get to the south and southeast, that severe threat will go down, but I think everyone has a chance for some rain going into tomorrow. So here's what future sky forecast is showing by 930. We're going to really be tracking that front with some heavy rain, possibly some severe thunderstorms right out of our viewing area along the I-40 and I-44 corridor that will start to push towards the southeast. And then I think we could see the front move in around lunchtime and then severe weather possible from 1 to 3 p.m going into your Sunday afternoon. So here's where that is right now. 3.30 p.m. We have severe weather possible right on the heels of Texoma along the I-35 corridor. That will move further and further to the southeast uh, throughout the evening. And we have a chance for severe weather throughout the evening and even overnight into your Monday. Rain chances will be possible almost every day next week. Damaging winds are the main threat with that, with flooding and possible isolated large hail. So here's what future sky for or future rainfall total, I should say, looks like going into your Monday. Half an inch for Paul's Valley. I do think some localized areas could see some flooding out west. Hilton there coming in at 1.27 inches. And we do have more rain in store for us next week. 40% chance for us towards the I-35 corridor tomorrow. 20% for southeast. And then Sunday, here's your hour-by-hour -hour forecast. I'll have more details on more rain next week tonight on K-10.